Here's the Google Pixel 8 Pro. I'm going to show you how to set this up step by step. First thing is turn it on. Press and hold that power button until it boots up. Then you should be at this welcome screen here. From here, go ahead and choose your language. And I'm good with the English in the US. I'm going to tap on Get Started right there. Set up using another device to copy settings, accounts, and more from another phone or tablet. Keep it nearby and unlocked, okay? So you can go ahead and copy your settings with a uh, another Pixel or Android device or an iPhone or iPad. If you want to do it that way, bring the device close and tap whatever one is down here. For myself, I want a fresh, clean install on this phone, and I will tap on Skip for myself. Connect to Wi-Fi so we can get that latest software update input your Wi-Fi password after you put your Wi-Fi password in tap on connect getting your phone ready this may take a few minutes checking network info asking you to sign into your Google account basically your Gmail you can go and sign in now or if you don't have an account you can create an account or you can go ahead and skip and you can sign in and do all that stuff later, which I'm going to do. I'm going to tap on skip right there again. It says here, connect to your mobile network. So from here, it's saying you can go ahead, you can download your eSIM, or you can go ahead and insert a physical SIM card. Okay, you can do this now, or you can do it later. I'm going to do this in a video after I'm done setting everything up. Okay, you can do it that way as well. So for myself, I'm going to skip this part. I'm going to tap on skip for now. Select a PIN password. You can skip this, but I'll advise make some kind of PIN right now. It's only four digits, so let me go ahead and choose my PIN here. After you type in your four-digit PIN, tap on Next. It's going to ask you to reconfirm one more time. And then reconfirm, then tap on Confirm again down there. Set up a fingerprint unlock, basically a fingerprint password. Uh, you can do this now, or you can go no thanks and never do it, or you can go no thanks and set it up later. I'm going to go ahead and set this up now, so I'm going to tap on agree, I agree right there. And you can see the fingerprint sensor is right here, and I'm going to tap on start. And I'm just going to go ahead and use my thumb here, and then I'm just going to... I feel it vibrating every time I touch it. Just wait till that circle completes. Just keep on going. Okay, now from here you can add another fingerprint if you wish, or you can just click on next. You can always add another fingerprint later as well. Set up face unlock. This is basically your face ID password. You can go ahead and no thanks and set that up later if you wish, or never set it up, or you can do it now. For me, I'm going to go ahead and set mine up now. I'm going to tap on I agree right there. And now I'm going to go ahead and tap on start right here. And I'm going to go ahead and look right into it. Look directly into it. Oops, okay, there we go, looks good. I'm gonna tap on done right there. Google services, use location, allow scanning, and send usage and diagnostic data. These are all optional, so that's up to you. Okay, for me, I'm fine having all those toggled on. I will tap on accept. Limited warranty, you can go ahead and read through that, like if you're in the US or whatnot. Let me tap on next here. Additional legal terms, read through that. You have to accept to proceed. Review additional apps. Go ahead and read through these. Some of these you don't want. You can uncheck, whatever. Or you can always uninstall them later on. For me, I'm fine with all these on here. And I will tap on OK. Here's a little tutorial. Swipe to navigate. Learn gestures to go home. Go back and switch apps. You can skip it or you can try it. We'll go ahead and try it here. To go home. From Oops. We'll go higher up like that. To go back, you can start from left. To right or right to left either or switching apps are basically your recents menu you can just go down like that and just kind of go up a little bit and then let go click on done swipe up to go home and we're in business you know how to insert a physical sim card look in the link below for this next video